came to the block, the whole Detroit. Detroit, make some noise, Detroit. The community was lovely this morning. Detroit came out, uh, it was a lot of love. Oh yeah, I'm blessed. I got the OGs with me. I ain't, you know, we ain't tripping about nothing. The next movie, I think, is We own this show. one, that one, that These one, two. them two. And that build. Because I just feel like if I'm going to take from my community, I got to pour into it. And I've been in them kids' seats before. I always wanted a rapper or somebody I looked up to to come reach back and touch me or something like that and pour it in the community that I was in. I'd probably be way better off. You see what's going on with Detroit? I'm known as Detroit Slim because I be out here so much. I don't know why he out here with me, but you know, this is million dollars worth of game. Listen, Skiller Baby Edition. We came to the block, the whole Detroit. Detroit, make some noise, Detroit. We out here, listen, man. Listen, this, we got baby money out here. We went through the block. Listen, been showing love to him since, you know, forever. But Detroit is active, it's going down. If you don't know, you're going to find the f out. That's all I'm going to say. But listen, tonight is going to be a movie. We just running around with him all day, showing you a different edition. You know, million dollars worth of game go to the hood. We don't sit in, we don't sit in rooms and just have mics. We go to the hood where a lot of y'all can't go. We got to tap in with our people. Look around here. This is our family right here. This is our family. We go and tap in with the soil. It's just like that million dollars worth of game. Skill a baby. Tap in. And it's just like that. Right. Hey, this be almost like a TV chat, I'm not gonna lie. Why? Them my houses right there. Them my s right there. I own I own this one, this one, that one, and that building. He own this one, that one, that he one. Is two. Them two. And that building. Four houses on the on, block, man. I'm working on this one right now. Man, okay. So this is your whole block then, basically? Yeah. We rehabbing them right now. This was this. All these was up like that. Like, I had to. I just got these like a couple months ago, too. I'm about to start. They just gutted all you that. See, out. they got the dumpsters right there. They, they getting busy right now. Yeah, they charge me about an hour for them whole dumpsters. Gutted everything out them. I'm about to start. They got to put the porch up, and then I'm going to wait to do that one because that's terrible on the inside. That one terrible. Oh, that yeah. one right there? Yeah, like that that's big disaster. over there. Yeah, I yeah, got the, that for 20000 Yeah, the, um, they finna redo the hospital, made that bitch to a virtual hospital and shit. Yeah. Like, it's a billion dollars. They about to extend that Oh, yeah, so it's ready so on. So all these going to go oh, up in property. I go up in value. Right. I got these for 20000 I probably can sell these bitch. Three, four hundred. When I get done with them, and and they about to build the Lions facility right there, the oh, practice facility. Oh, so you on point? Yeah. Oh, this is cool. Oh, that. Sh Next time I have y'all see these, they gonna be crazy. They gonna be up. Yes, yeah, what a god. That's what I'm talking about. Who who gave you the game to get come grab some of this real estate? I always wanted to. I when I I told myself when I got some money, I was gonna do something with my money. So I always just, like, I ain't had no money, but I was like, this is what I'm gonna do when I got money. You know, like, all the old dope men and shit, that's what they do, they buy houses. So that was the smartest shit for me to do. I, I don't know nothing else. Like, I be, like, trying to book myself, get black trucks and shit like that, like, trying to do fleets and shit like that. But this, like, the smartest thing I knew I could do. Especially, like, saving my money, because I don't really need money, because I got coming in. So I ain't trying to, like, fix them up and sell them. I'm trying to fix them up, put people in them and just, you know, I know if I got like 40 houses by next year, I get like 1,500 out of them, I'd be at least, I can make at least 60,000 a month, 70,000 a month. So that's how I just be, I be trying to play it the smart way for real. But, but these are my houses over here. I just wanted to show you all this. I'm like one of the youngest black developers in Detroit. That's what it's about, man. You on point. They in there smoking that Reggie. I don't even smoke, so. 
If he's smoking Reggie, that's that's old Gilly Gill, OG. I ain't smoking no Reggie. <laughs> I hope you ain't smoking no gank in Detroit. If, I, if I'm smoking Reggie in Detroit, that's on Trick Trick. Now you gonna throw Trick Trick I under the bus? I ain't throwing Trick Trick under the bus. You gonna put y'all OG under the bus? We don't even play with the Gold Squad, man. Those boys, those boys, the Gold Squad. We don't even. We let Trick Trick be Trick Trick. Uncle Trick gonna be Uncle Trick. You feel me? I already said some whole. On, on the shade room the other day about Eminem, we listen to Eminem. We love him. Yeah. We love him. Right. <laughs> we love him. Don't don't be mad at me. Why we can go now? What you want, Bass? Let me know. I'm gonna get up. I'm gonna hop on. Simmers, having fun with The Sims 4 and curious about adding mods? Well, this video is for you. Finally, you can find and install mods and custom content hey, for The Sims 4 easily and safely. Introducing CurseForge, oh, the ultimate mod and custom content hub for The Sims 4. With over 40,000 mods and custom content made by top content hey, creators, boy, that's tough, though, enjoy curated top quality content, to including body and clothing options, new rooms, Nigga was in a city? That got a hot show out? Damn! What's up? You see them free food I brought up? Hell yeah! Where we at, man? Where we at, huh? We in the west side. Ready? There you go. The west side, man. The west side. Hey. Huh? So why did you decide to catch me out today? You give me the, you give me the tease off the love, I was just gonna give it to you for free. Because I support you, man. You out here trying to do something. Of course. So I would rather give you, pay you, than you give me something for free because you put your time and your effort and your love into that. So you deserve for me to pay you now. My fault, OG. What up, what up? Appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all. You too, bro. Appreciate y'all. Oh, yeah. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all for pulling up, bro. Nice to meet y'all. Appreciate y'all. He, Uncle Q got the food truck right there. I told him you about to come get some food. I need him. Listen, he just assaulted me. What you mean, he just assaulted me what over there? Do? I'm taking your badge now. I got to report both of y'all. Y'all not doing your job out here in Detroit. Y'all supposed to be... That's what I'm saying. See, she want to play. We, we, Every we city it. we go to, he try to get me locked no, up. No, we want. I'm gonna make a. I know. I'm gonna make I a report on y'all. Take him down I to the. Cause y'all not locking that. him up. Why is she? No, I'm she not. Said, hold, why up, you hold, up, hold up, hold up, hold up, yes. hold up, 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 I, that's what I'm I saying. Don't I don't know even know it. That's my little cousin. He, he just, always he trying just, to get me locked. But I'm saying y'all need to be relocating real What quick. happened was he did 20 years in jail when he said I need a little vacation. He needed a vacation. I don't believe that. But listen, any day, so you, you if you want to, you can cover it. No, that's what, no. You don't you hug no in 20 years in jail. Come on, come on. You want to take a picture, come on. Come on, get, no, get out of my picture, man. You, come on, man, this ain't for you. I won't vote for y'all. See, but, but I want a picture by myself. Okay, and Take a picture by myself, oh, Rob. I'm, I, no, get him out of my picture. He's a <laughs> get him out of my picture. Come on, get this picture, Rob. Look at this. Living the life, baby. <laughs> All right. I mean, I'm going to holler at y'all later. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
Uh, let me, I mean, hit the joint, hit the line later, man. Yeah, yeah, so, so somebody watching this 15, 16, they don't know their way in life, what they want to do yet. If they broke, they struggling. What's some advice? Some advice is you, you're going to be all right because you still got time. Don't put no pressure on you based on yourself based off what everybody yeah. else is doing on social media. You, you know, like a lot of people want to I mean? be like you right now at 20. They feel like they're behind because they see Skiller, he may be younger. But you lit and you what, 30, 40, whatever? No, I'm 45. So you're 45. Did you ever see this coming when you was in jail? Like you were sitting down in nah, jail? Nah, nah, I, I was getting my life together. I ain't see a lot of coming. So yeah. I, just, I came home and put it on the ground and just kept going. You know I what seen mean? that video where you had $1,000. You said, I'm going to turn this to $100,000. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. this. Do, when you go back, do they give you chills looking at that? Like, like really? Like, do that? How do that feel? You come out here, people love you. Like, how does that really feel? Truly? It's a blessing, man. You know, I wouldn't be able to do any of this without God. Yeah. And it was just that I was, I was, I was, I wanted it. I yeah. wanted it. You know what I mean? Just hung. Hey, look, you gonna remember, remember my face, gang? Keep like, going hard, baby. Remember my face. Hey. All right, keep going hard. Find a rim. Well, I'ma just say this I too, right? I'm I'm gonna gonna just say this too. I got a baldy from in Detroit today, right? <laughs> he cleaned my <laughs> shit, right? He did good. He gave me the Detroit mustache. <laughs> you see? <laughs> Look at his. <laughs> Look at his. <laughs> Look at his. What's up with my mustache? He gave me the Detroit mustache. That's how you gotta do it. <laughs> he gave me a little ass. Yeah, that's a Detroit mustache for you. That nigga ain't lying. <laughs> Look at this shit. Hold on, let me go. Where's some other at? Look at this shit, man. Right he gave me the Detroit mustache. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> you, you got the whispers, Joy. Look at Detroit mustache. <laughs> Look at the little thin joint. <laughs> Look, he gave me the Detroit. Look at that shit, man. Look at your joint. Thinner than a mother. Look at his puppy. Yeah. Look at his joint. Thin. I got a Detroit stash, man. They gave me the Detroit joint. Gito, you in the hood? They cut my shit today, man. Gave me the little stash, man. Look at my mini joint. I ain't never had no stash like that, man. He said, he said I ain't never had no stash like that. That nigga got the Detroit mustache. Nah, that is funny, bro. He ain't lying, though. Nigga, I got the same one, chat. They got the thin piece, nigga. Nah, he ain't lying, though. You from Detroit? Yeah, he got the Detroit stash, too. Look, <laughs> they gave me this low ass joint to do. <laughs> Look at this. You got it. It's crispy as hell, ain't it? Look at low ass stash. He said, You want me to shape that? I said, Man, go ahead and do it. See, I cut my own sh This is the first time I cut my sh 20 something years, man. Because I ain't have my clippers, man. That shit start growing back in. That shit be itching and shit. Get this shit off my face, man. That nigga gave me the Detroit stash, man. I called my wife. She started laughing like a mother, man. She seen me with that little ass stash, man. We are trying to flirt. She wait for her nigga to walk away. It looks so good. You look so good with it, though. You look so good. Yeah, big motion. That's the little boy. Big motion. You know what you tell him? Say I'm little, but I got big motion. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, baby. I'm little, but I got big motion. You hear me? Not little motion. Big motion. Don't get it tangled and twisted like an Annie Ann's pretzel. You hear me? Yeah, you like that. I saw you, you taking that game. I see you soaking it in. Yeah, that's why you soak that game in. Yeah, I mean, you know what you tell him? Say it's three types of people. It's people from around the way. It's people that's in the way, and what else? It's people that make a way, big motion. Yeah, he's soaking it up, yeah, yeah. Now what you say, I give you that. I'm gonna say inspired by Gilly. Yeah, don't worry about it. He know he do millions. How old are you? Eight. Yeah, but see by the time he 11, then his, his vocabulary is upgraded. He talking, talking like young. You hear me? Yeah. That's that little kid that's like big motion. You hear me? He had that mouthpiece then. You hear me? Alright. Believe that. You know he was a I can't chat. I'm gonna be I'm up chat. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna be like this one day, chat. I'm I'm gonna be the neighborhood hero one day, chat. No cap. I'll follow you. With Diddy. Big motion. <laughs> hey. Hold on to that. Come on, man. Hold this for me, man. We gotta do a video, man. Come on, man. 
we gotta do a good morning video, man. All right. Nah, for real. We gonna do a joint. You That's gonna love. say good? You know what I mean? You gonna say good morning? Good morning, right? Oh, come on. We gotta get this off, man. Are right, you you? When we start, you gonna say good morning, good morning, and then you gonna give him a word for the day. Good morning. Good, good morning. morning. Every day you wake up, it's not gonna be a good day, but every day it's a blessing. I get up and get some money and get your mind. Big motion. Big motion. That's what I'm talking about, Neff. Hey, let me give you some of this paper, man. I mean, now Jason Tatum is mad. Even the can't wish. Now Jason Tatum, now you're a Celtics fan and a Lions fan because they win it. You another. Right, look, look, look. <laughs> you think he could beat me one on one? Be honest. Huh? You think he could beat me one on one? <laughs> I'm sorry, you think? Wait, you think he could beat me one on one? Don't delete it, nigga. Wait, wait. Don't delete it now. Wait. You knew he was gonna say you. Hey, why you do me like that, I can't go lie to you. Look, look, look. This is one of my big nephews. Guess guess what he gonna do to you? He's gonna make love to you. Right now. I'm not no diddy. No Diddy. No, no, Diddy. Make love to me. Don't say that shit. No, no, Diddy. No, he not. No, he's not. Oh, oh. We won't let him say some shit like that about you. You better stay that three point line. You're going to make love to him. You're going to start screaming. You're going to start screaming. OG, you can't say no shit like that, OG. OG, clean that shit. We on camera, man. Because you're going to be crying when you come down. Oh, my God. Lord, have mercy. I'm done. Lord, have Oh, my God. Oh, Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord. Not on duty, man. Not the on duty, Oi. You better shoot a three. Not on duty, Oi. Take a picture with the guy. Million dollar worth the game? Talk to me. We on million dollar worth the game? Yeah. Okay. That's what's up. Y'all in the hood with it. We always in the hood. Y'all in the hood with it? It's the interview right now? Yeah, if you want it to be. I can interview you? Yeah. Okay. So how long you been doing podcasts? Five years. Five years. You like it? Love it. Love it. Who's the most influential person you interviewed? Myself. Yourself? Who's your favorite person you interviewed? I don't know. We interviewed a lot of people. You know, I got a lot of favorites. You got a lot of favorites? Yeah. But you had to pick one. I can't pick one. You can't pick one. Lil Dirk, Young Dirk. Thug, Floyd Mayweather, Mike Tyson, DeVito, okay. Burner Boy. Toosie. Okay. I like that. Everybody. Lotto. Everybody. Cardi B. Sex. Glorilla. All that. Kevin Durant. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Man. I like I that. I got a lot of favorites. I like that. Some I ain't even mentioned. Now Skiller Baby. Now Skiller Baby. Yeah. West Side of Detroit. West Side of Detroit. Yeah. West Side of the D. Yeah, I mean. That nigga Sada there, nigga Sada, Huncho, Skilla, niggas popped up. You see what's going on? I just willing to bike down the street. Bike Boys Detroit, we's doing it, baby. Baby money. The one plugin that I want to showcase here is this bad boy. It's called the God Particle. The only thing that you Snake could have never been our getaway driver. No, we'd have been locked up. He was a getaway driver. Yeah. Yes, yeah, Susky. Detroit, yes, yes, sir. We're here. Detroit in the. You yes, understand? Detroit's how you, Detroit, how you be, brother. Yes, sir, baby. Nah.
bitch ass. You gotta always realize tomorrow's gonna be better than yesterday. You know what I'm saying? Be better than yesterday. Yeah, because you you know you get caught up in the moment. Yeah. And you might feel like you at your lowest. Right. But you gotta reconnect with that energy when you got through that shit before and Straight get up. through it again. Straight up. I just think a lot of times people, you know, it's easy to dwell. You got all these images that you're looking at on so yeah. on this. Yeah. It'll have you messed up sometimes. It'll finesse you out of sure. your blessings. For sure. Because you'll be blessed. That's facts. But you'll be overlooking, you'll be looking over over your blessings. That's looking facts. Looking at somebody else illusions yeah. and you be thinking damn I ain't doing enough I just think you just got to stay focused man just know that tomorrow whatever you're going through today you're going to get through it and tomorrow is going to be better that's facts nice. appreciate you always man that's love love man always you hyping that shit up man. I'm not even gonna say shit bro I'm old I'm older nigga you ain't tell me about no sweet potato pie you man uh oh he about to wow this shit better be what it poses we'll see he talking Crazy too. Spicy. Damn, it look like it ain't even got no crust. Mm -hmm. Listen. You don't even need no crust. Watch this. Watch this. I don't even want to say, don't say no. Let me see. Let me see. It's an eyebrow for me. Uh, Still digging. I want to hate, but I can't. Oh, exactly. Thank you. Listen, man, we out here, man. Just had a crazy show. I'm talking about, listen, yes. Skillet shut it down today. Yes. They shut him down. Yes. It was just crazy, man. Listen, man, yes. how you feel, man, though? We had a good day outside of the show. Oh, yeah, I'm blessed. I got the OGs with me. I ain't, you know, we ain't tripping about nothing. The community was lovely this morning. Detroit came out. Uh, it was a lot of love. It just, it just, it was a whole family environment on the block, man. Mm -hmm. How did you feel about that? Just coming through and you brought some artists through. 
they was connected with the people. How you feel about that? I'm just got glad I got to show y'all what Jack Harlow is talking about. Mm -hmm. You feel me? But why is it so important? You you do gun buybacks. You always with the kids with the sports. Why is it so important for you to do all that? Cause I just feel like if I'm gonna take from my community, I got to pour into it. Like, mm -hmm. uh, and I've been in them kids' seats before. I always wanted a rapper or somebody I looked up to to come reach back and touch me or something like that and pour it in the community that I was in. I'd probably be way better off. Well, let me say this. I knew you was that before I got But now, seeing that shit in person, this is the first time I got to see that shit in person. Kofi! He lied though, bro. Detroit niggas a different breed of niggas, bro. No cap. Really that like. Appreciate you, Audrey. And you that and you accelerating. Your shit is going like this. Like, you see every, and you one of the most consistent. I see you in the car, you just pull that phone out and just pop your shit. How does it feel? I mean, I feel, like I said, I just feel blessed. I remember like, just dreaming about shit like that. Like, I used to watch everybody around me turn up and stuff, and I just used to be happy for them. And you know, you'd be like, damn, I can't wait to have that type of, feel me, and it don't be no envy or nothing. You just be like, you be motivated by everybody around me. Like, everybody around me was turned, you know? And I just appreciate having my turn, like, you know? I just want to share my light with other people, too. You fresh off tour, how do it feel knowing you go city to city and sell out? Oh, uh, City to city. I, I, cause you know, like, it's, we such in the streaming world right now, I get real love and real life. So, like, I'd rather pull up to my shows and they sold out than stream more than everybody and come outside and nobody like me. I I just rather that. Like I feel blessed. Like I get real love and real life. One th one thing I can say about me and Wallow, the the love that we get a lot of the times is from the human connection that we make because people just feel like when they see us, man, that's just Gillian Wallow. They what, what they see is what they get. I feel like with a that's lot important. of artists is not like that's that. That's important though. But, that's important, chat. That's important. What's good, Twitch? Free the concert stream, bro. You just missed the the cooking stream, bro. I just made some food, um, but I ate it all. I'm I'm gonna post it on YouTube though, and we gonna and we react to uh Gillo and Wallow in Detroit. With Skilla, it's it's like what you see is what you get. No, that's He's fair. He's just a genuine good nigga. He crack jokes. He, he, you feel what I'm saying? And he just a just it ain't no facade to this shit. It's just like this is just me, and even you fuck with me or you, you not. Where did you get that ability at to just be like that? Um, I think, I think I just you go through so much stuff like just y'all street, you street guys, so y'all know like you go through so much stuff and you trying to find yourself just growing up. I finally just I went through so much stuff. I just had to tell myself like, don't stress over nothing you can't control. I can't control if nobody like me. I can't control if you like me. I can't control if nothing like stuff like that. So I just be myself and if you like me, you like me. If you don't, you don't. And I'm unapologetically myself and I'm the type of people I like to be around. So I just like to pat myself after being like that. Like, you know? I see you loving the women heavy. You loving the women heavy, like, you know, what, 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 what encourage that? What, 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 you know, what empower that to get us women so much love? Like, you know, we live in a world where, as you know, social media, you always see the battle of men and women and everybody, a lot of times women get tore down. What, what empower you to just love them so much through your lyrics? My daddy used to tell me, like, you only got one mom and stuff like that. Like, I, my daddy was like that type of guy. Like, so I was raised by like an old school. My daddy was born in 1946. So like the values I, I stand on, a lot of people don't have those values because they come from young families and stuff like that. So, um, I don't know. I just, I love my mama. I'm real, I'm real close to my mom and my sisters. I was raised around a lot of girls. And then as a kid, like, I ain't gonna lie. As a kid, I had a problem with authority and like, um, like disrespecting, like, I was, I was a daddy's kid. Like, I love my daddy, not the most, but I, I was just, yeah. like glue yeah. so I kind of neglected my mama in a way like from like from like till I was like eight or nine like I didn't want to do what she said and stuff and then 
out of nowhere, like my dad died and I got closer and closer to my mama. I always was closer to her, but I just, our relationship got better and I just, I matured and it just, it just come with maturity and stuff going through life. Like, now my mama, like, we want, that's one of the closest people to me. I only got like five people that's close to me. Do it become harder for the ladies? Cause now and all the ladies checking for you, you become harder cause you believe in love and all that stuff. So, so is it harder for you now to make your decision or decide or to settle down or you just feel like I'm chilling? I mean, I just go with the flow. Like whatever God I want for me, yeah. that's what I want for me. I ain't trying to force it. I ain't trying to do nothing. I love who I love and I love who love me. That's all. It's back. Say what you cook. I cooked some, um, I've cooked food steak and cheese. Yeah, answer. that was a hell of an answer. That was a nice, that was a nice for two evening. That was some real out of the tree pimp shit. Yeah, you know, said, I, love, I, love, I love, I love, I love, 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 love me. me. Yeah. <laughs> Slide around and shit. Uh, now, now, what keep you grounded though, man? We had, we, we was at the BET basketball game slash million dollars every game. You dealing with the people, you connect with the Let's fans. Let's put that out there. He got, they got cooked. Yeah, I thought he was going to do more than what he said he was going to do because yeah. he, he been telling you some well, stuff for hey, a while. Y'all went down 25. He was frustrated. Yeah, no, he, he said he that. He, like, he, he blamed it on me. Tell me, you did a bad I coaching move. I got the first four, five points. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he did, he did. He I did. had like the first he was four, balling. five points. Y'all took said, me out. He said, take pull the, uh, a bad we stayed, taking them stayed yeah, in. because Tank was in there with a weight belt on under his jersey. Yeah, he threw all that shit. And the elite chopper went for about 40 before we even crazy. got, got he back here. He went crazy. I kept feeding him because he was hot. Gilly throwing passes oh, like this. Uh, he was a bitch like, man, why you let Tank tell me? Why you let Tank stay in there? I said, man, yeah. um, you know what I mean? Let him do his thing. But but you just so down to earth. How do you stay grounded, man? The money here, the success here, the fame here, the attention here. How do you stay grounded? You stay. I'm blessed just to be here for real, for real. To be honest, like, you gotta think like this. I mean, people I I looked up to and was watching since I was a kid, yeah, yeah, you gotta think like that. Like, uh, I mean, these people are still a fan of them. Mm -hmm. So I'm still fanned out when I see them, I tell them, I don't really care. Like, I'm blessed. I'm, I could take care of my family, I get money consistently. I came from nothing. So when you come from nothing, everything is a plus. It's, it's nothing is a negative. Anything I have is a plus. I started with zero. You said earlier you take care of a lot of people, man. How does it feel to be responsible and keep delivering and seeing that your people that you love is in a better position because you out here putting it down? How do that feel? It's a blessing. You get what you ask for. Like I ask to be somebody that people can depend on. I hated being, having to depend on people. I hated being in that position. I love the stress that come with everything that come with my life. Um, you know, everything you do when you doing something positive, it come with negative and positive. So I, I love it. I don't get high, I don't drink. I like to go through all my emotions. I want to be happy, sad, mad, all that. Like, I go from, you see, I go from irritated to back blessed with y'all, happy to do this. Like, one second, I don't really, I don't really dwell on that. So, so, what's next? I heard some new music. I was in the car with Juan. I heard some, I heard some stuff. So, what's next? Uh, I got um, the deluxe coming out. I'm working with, I, I showed Gilly some stuff Juan don't even got, but I got some big features coming. Yes. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Hey, nigga, listen to me. Yeah, you ain't tell me. That work. I'm glad you said, Rob was, oh, yes. He banged that shit. Oh, my goodness. I ain't even And I just want to say, I want to I personally thank you because that shit you sent New York, L.A., oh, my God. I, love I ain't New York, LA. my bitch because I love my bitch. Yeah, I don't see nobody she, else because my buffs got yeah, shit. She, she told you she got them. What'd she, 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 she like, tell you? When that first verse ain't it. Yeah. She sent it back. What'd you say? I Gladly. I don't want nobody, I don't want to get nobody, no verse that they don't like. And I I, I was kind of iffy on the verse. So She's like, do this. I did it and she liked it. I, that's why I appreciate her for giving it. She that for real. Oh, that's all right. She be going there. She I can't that. wait to shoot the video. You know, I was going down. You know what it is? Because I, I heard it, the first version. I'm like, he doing something different. I'm like, you know, you you it might be different for him because he, he, you know, she was like, but she listened to the nigga. She was like, no, dad, he come way harder than this bitch. Dad, I'm telling you, no, he, I'm gonna I'm ask him, cause I, so I'm like, that nigga sent that second verse. I second said, verse. nigga, she was all the way right. This nigga <laughs> fucked that shit up. <laughs> <laughs> so we 
club this and get drunk this in. <laughs> you want me to leave my tell bitch? <laughs> you was talking that shit. That's so oh hard though. Because yeah. I appreciate her because I ain't never did a beat like that. Yeah. And she put me on the Timberland John. Yeah. You feel me? That's major. Yeah. I shouldn't ever even expose that. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm going to keep it all the way real. I talked to Tim and, and, and his homie, and they was yeah. like, we gotta shoot a video ASAP. We gotta shoot a video, Kelly. I said, all right. That, that video gotta be all the way right, too. We can't oh, have that. We're gonna make sure it's tight. Make sure it's tight. Give you this DVD itself. You know that Philly hospitality laid the, the car out, man. I remember I told you I ain't think Philly had good food, and you brought that one lady. Yeah, Pretty Girls Cook. He was he was talking crazy. He told me I ain't think nobody nobody had no food. We brought Pretty Girls Cook. He was back there. He would he would come from that back seat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure she dress you up again. Let me do a quick rapid fire. You ready? Uh, Jordan or LeBron? I'm gonna go Jordan. I like I. I, I we'll step in this, cuz. This would be it. I was with the game. I'm okay. I'm gonna go Jordan. But I like LeBron now more. The, I used the, to hate this, LeBron. This ain't one of them explaining jokes. This just from Jordan. 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 Okay. All right. Yeah. Well, hold on. Let me ask a question. Gilly or NLE Chopper? Gilly. Ooh. Chopper, yeah. Thug or Future? Future. I gotta go Future. Pull it up. Isaiah Thomas, Kyrie Irving. Isaiah, Zeke, for sure. Damn. I knew he was gonna do that. You didn't train that thing up. And, and I'm gonna say, Isaiah got that dog in him. Like, he'll bite you. Like, for real, he he was doing whatever to win. Barry Sanders and Emmitt Smith. Barry Sanders, I'm going home. Come mm. on, man. He did that with no line. Come on, man. You, you gotta think I that. mean, I would have said Barry Sanders, too. He did that with no line. Cole Pepper or Randy Moss? Randy Moss. I messed it up. Hold that's that cold pepper quarterback, though. But Randy I messed, Moss I messed over everybody. Up. I meant to say, I meant to say, uh. See, that's why you don't let this nigga do rapid fire. Jerry Rice. This motherfucker say shit. But Jerry Rice caught bricks. This motherfucker say shit. No way. Reggie White or Barry White. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry. Wallow, though. Jerry Rice caught bricks. I forgot bricks, Randy Moss and Cole Pepper. <laughs> Jerry Rice that's caught bricks, real. though. But you got to think, <laughs> Moss changed the coach. But you got to hear the crazy, man. This, this nigga said the quarterback and the wide receiver. Joe Montana. I thought, no, I ain't say Joe Montana, I said Cole Pepper. What I'm saying, that's the same thing. Cole Pepper, Randy Moss. They was playing on the same team, right? Him Floyd or him catching? Wasn't he playing on Minnesota? Yeah, that's why this nigga hit. You'd rather see him throw it or him catch it. That's crazy, man. I don't know, man. I was off that season. But listen, man. We was live from Detroit. A beautiful day. The west side, to be exact. Yeah. I'm going to say this, too. That fucking, what's the name of that shit, man? Nigga took me to Coney Island. That shit was good. Then he stopped that fucking Mickey D's Coney Island. I tipped you in there $200 for a plain hamburger that was burnt. You I said, fuck fucking D's. hockey putt. Why you said you Mickey D's was the best. Mickey D's. Mickey D's. Mickey D's. Detroit one not even the best one. Uh, uh, we supposed to take him to L. Georgia's or Zorba's. If you're on the west side, go to L. Georgia's. If you're on the east side, go to Zorba's. He took you to the bad zone. He took me to the bad zone, man. Did you like? No, he like. We leave in the morning. You guys think Detroit one? I my daddy stayed in that senior citizen building right, next door. Right. I used to be over there all day. Used to have chickens outside that bitch. <laughs> Listen to you, I swear to God. They, you still ain't out that bitch. You was a sad bitch. I got, I caught Congress in the 20s in that. I got all that type of shit in that. You wanted the baddest shit. wanted a burger and some chili fries, baddest shit. You wanted the out of 20. I would have I used to go all around this bitch and call me fake babies. Fake babies. Uh, we used to call them good babies. Them 20s were them responsible for Christmas. <laughs> getting them off. For sure. 20 at a time. Weed man, I got so many of y'all weed men with him. <coughs> y'all getting this herb and anything. You know them niggas ain't had no market. He go at they night. They fooling with that At house. nighttime. Yeah. Oh, wrinkle it up. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he trying to get some smoke. <laughs> the dude, the, you devious ass nigga riding around D-Town oh, burning niggas for food. Man, niggas is crazy about that weed. We ready to get up out of here. Million dollars for every game live from Detroit, man. It's killer baby, man. It was a great day in Detroit, man. I love you it. You know man. the city love OG and them too. Wait, hold on. Before we get out of here, because your your name just used to be Skiller. Mm -hmm. Seeing shit I learned when I'm in. Skills. What means you had the baby to it? 
I don't know. I just started rapping and it had to be fancy. Like, I just thought it had to be fancy. My name was originally Skills. If they would have left me in the game, I would have showed y'all why my name was Skills. You feel me? What game? That one game where y'all kept taking oh, me out. Oh, man, come on. You got in there. You had 20 minutes in the game. You pulled the score. You scored By five points. By the time points. I got back in there, we was down 25. 25. But well, what they got to do with him? We the came game. back to 10. You remember, we, Friday got us back to like 10 points. Friday? Friday was in his score. You remember, he was in his score, got us back to like 10 points. But y'all still took off on us. You got, you got to think a basketball is a game of runs. You yeah. got, when you in the Friday rhythm, 20 points. when you in the rhythm, you you good. Right. Once you just discouraged. Right. That's it's fucked up, man. I started the game off first five points. Boom, 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 lay up. I don't three. think they would have called you skills, though. They probably called you no skills, because that was, that was mid. That game wasn't, because I, I I got in there and did what I needed to do. What? Four fouls. Talk. What you mean? I ain't. You was 0 for 4, you had four fouls. Me and, me and what's the name had the big play of the game? Me and uh, oh, yeah. Lola. Yeah, Lola. She slammed, it was over. Yeah, this nut ass nigga. We was already down a lot, though. Yeah. By the time we got back in, it was a lot to a little bit. My ACL was messed win. up. That's us. Some niggas just didn't want to make a play. No, my, my ACL messed up. I had to tell myself, this is just a celebrity game. Yeah, you <laughs> start taking that shit personally. You was mad as shit. So, he came who right was mad? Who was mad? Was mad. Like, all that old crazy shit. Tate was snapping over here, man. Tate was yeah. Tate was like, no. We got to get in the game. Mike, right, come on. Leave, <laughs> leave me in the game for five more minutes. <laughs> five more minutes. <laughs> just five he more told minutes. Kenya, Kenya said, all right. He said, keep this five in. We out of here. You know what I mean? That's what it was about, man. Got y'all niggas cooked. Though. Yeah. Ooh. Take out that fucking weak on under this jersey. Oh. And these pads all like like Patrick Gillard. Y'all was shooting the blood Detroit. out the board, though. I ain't gonna lie. Y'all yeah, can that's shoot. That's what we do. Live from Detroit. It's just like that. And it's just like that. Right. Oh, my God. Look at this, cuz. Cuz, look at it. Look, look, she got the throwback picture on there. I'm sorry that happened. I hope y'all still love it. Look, look, look. She got the throwback <laughs> picture of me and Gil. This back in like 90. Oh, yeah, I ain't even five. see the throwback. That's I ain't what Gil. My husband did this. He's a graphic designer. His name is He's Goldie. a beast. He did this for y'all. Is it okay if I take this out real quick? Yeah, yeah, come on. Let's get a picture. We got those <laughs> babies in the club that night. You know what I mean? He was in club dance. You see, look at this, man.